All right, good. I know that this is evidence, though, that the hack was installed properly, because it actually says Bro Mode. I think they've actually added some custom assets in the game as well. Uh oh, I had this. I had to say it out loud. It's stuttering a little bit, but not too bad. File one has been created. All right, folks. <laughs> So, hi YouTube, when this is going up. Uh, now that Backyard Baseball is over, I'm going to play Paper Mario Pro Mode, a hack that has been made for the original Paper Mario to make it more difficult. I don't know what exactly that entails, but I think it just means that enemies have buffed stats. But I've also heard they added new badges to the game as well, and potentially new items as well. So, this could be very interesting. Marty, I'm not naming myself Garbage. Why would I name myself Garbage? <laughs> I'm actually good at this game. Hey, Proxima! How's it going? <laughs> Glad to see you here. Yeah, yeah, Paper Mario. This is my number two favorite game in for people who don't know, so I'm excited. Let's see what this game's all about. Well, I know what the game's all about. Let's see what this hack is all about. Mail call. I'm assuming the dialogue is completely unchanged. Because, again, I don't think that they really added a lot of... I think they literally just made the game more difficult. Hey, Mario, we got the letter from Princess Peach. And hey, listen, bro, I know you're illiterate, so I'll read it to you, okay? <laughs> Not cool, bro. This might be a love letter. <laughs> All right, let's see. <laughs> I'm throwing a party at my castle today. Mario and Luigi, I would be honored if you both could attend. Many guests from distant towns are hoping to meet you. There will be tasty sweets and all kinds of entertainment. I hope to see you soon. Sincerely, Peach. Look, we all know I can't do girls' voices, so I might as well go <laughs> as far in the opposite direction as possible, right? <laughs> That's logic. Oh, boy. Mario, I would just be so honored if you could come. My <laughs> Our families are really tight. Also, this game is one of the best soundtracks. Like, period. Then again, I'm gonna be gushing about how much I love the game in general. I've literally played this game three times for my channel now. Once as the regular Let's Play, once as the level one or level zero playthrough, and now this. What a magnificent castle! I never get used to this place. Looks like there's lots of guests already here. I hope that Paper Waluigi makes an appearance. <laughs> Hi, Nintendo addict. <laughs> How's it going? Hey, bro! I got a challenge for you. Do you want to hear it? This is new. This is for true veterans only. Are you sure you want to hear it? I mean, I'll hear it, sure. Here's the challenge. You can't earn any star points, but you can equip badges for free. Do you want to try it? Maybe not on my first playthrough. All right, then. Maybe next time. <laughs> that's like the level zero run. Oh, that's actually really cool. Oh, and I'm excited about that, because you know what that means? If that's in the game, then they've designed the game in such a way that you actually can beat it at level zero. And it might be difficult, but it'll still be possible. So I think that means the game's actually going to be a balanced amount of difficult, not stupidly difficult, which is great! Wow, I've never seen so many guests from different parts of the world in one place! I'll bet you can hear some stories about places you've never been to, huh? Oh, welcome. Oh, wait, that, I can't give her the fug voice, too. Ow, oh, welcome, Mario. That last party was lovely, wasn't it? Oh, by the way, Princess Peach has been waiting for you. Okay. Thanks. And yeah, I'll talk to her friend, too. I think Princess Peach has been looking forward to seeing you since this morning, Mario. She's been restless. <laughs> How cute. Okay, we're not talking to those toads again. Oh, yeah, I can spin! This ain't fast in your door! Oh, this, you're the same old toad. <laughs> Mario, you're looking well! Uh, please enjoy the party, okay? Yeah, come on, talk to him. Oh, welcome to Peach's castle! You don't have to look so scared, bro. Hey, uh, Mario, uh, I hope you brought an appetite. Uh, there's so much good food here. I already ate way too much. I'm taking a little breather. Oh, that's enough for the rest. I'm hungry again. Let's eat to the buffet table. That toad knows what's up. 
Ah, oh, salutations, Mario. Do you know Frost T here? He's come all the way from the Shiver region, which lies far to the north of here. I should probably stop talking to everybody and actually get on with the game. Princess Peach is such a generous and wonderful lady, just as I was told. It was worth coming for a visit. Mario, please visit us in the Shiver region someday. That's gonna be take a couple streams. Okay. Luigi had different dialogue, but I don't think anybody else really does, so that's cool. I'm here on behalf of the lovely Shiver City. I'm the mayor there, you know. My goodness, look at the time! I have to go shopping for souvenirs with Frost Tea! I come from Koopa Village, which is just down the road from here! Oh, I just had the honor of talking to Princess Peach! What a wonderful lady she is! She, she kind of had a, a deep voice, though. I'm worried. Is she taking up smoking? There's an intro skip toad soon as well. Nintendo Addict, have you played this hack before? <laughs> Oh man, I love the spin. Hey, dude, are you the intro skip toad? Ah, uh, Princess Peach just went into her private chambers just now. Oh, okay. Oh, I walked past him. Wazook! <laughs> it's nice and quiet here with no guests around. Ah, so pleasant! Is this the guy? I- I'm just a trainee, sir! So many guests, my heart's been beating like a bass drum ever since this morning! Thump a thump a thump! Whoa, why did it start lagging all of a sudden there? <laughs> this is Paper Mario Pro Mode, not Paper Mario Master Quest. I think those are two different hacks. Or maybe, maybe Master Quest was, like, a previous version of this. That's okay, I can go for the intro. Oh, Mario, you came to the party to see me? That's so sweet. Thank you. Don't mind me, I just had a bit of a cold today. I was just resting a bit. It gets tiring greeting all those guests out there. Nobody will bother us here. Shall we relax and chat, just the two of us? Oh yeah, this sounds like a good idea. <laughs> uh, it was a lovely day today, so I'm sure it's comfortable out on the balcony right now. Would you accompany me, Mario? <laughs> Fug life, Peach. Maybe I'll make that the thumbnail. Like, I'll take a- I'll take an image of Peach, and just put, like, the Thug Life sunglasses on her. <laughs> Good idea! I like how Mario's raising the roof during this sequence. This is also the Mario game where I like Bowser the most. Bowser's the perfect mix of, like, actual genuine fret and hilarious villain. Oh, are you all right, Mario? What in the world was that? Oh my, look, Mario. It's still daytime, isn't it? But I can see the stars outside! And that's how you make an entrance. How did Bowser build his whole castle under there as hers anyways? Very carefully! <laughs> Long time no see, Princess Peach! Bowser? But this can't be! It was you who made the ground shake just now, wasn't it? Whatever did you do? Oh no. Every time I do... Every time I do, like, evil laughs, I start getting the hiccups. This is bad. Hey, yeah, that was me! I lifted your castle up to the sky! I'm sitting on my castle now! Wasn't expecting that, huh? Ha! The castle's under my control now, my dear! Now you will obey me! Huh? What? It's... Mario? What a shock! Ha! Not really. I expected you to turn up right on cue. You're just as annoyed as ever. Unfortunately for you, there's nothing you can do this time. It's pro mode! <laughs> Haven't you learned your lesson yet now, Bowser? You could never defeat Mario. Why don't you give up already? True, true, I've had my problems in the past, but this time is different. 
This time I'm gonna win! Okay, tough guy, let's go! I wonder if this intro fight will actually be a little different. I mean, we're, we have to lose regardless. <laughs> Mario, you can do it! I think I've changed Peach's voice a few times now, but it's okay. Th the essence is the same. Okay, so that's the same. Will he deal more damage? Yeah! I think that's a little... I can't remember if he always deals two or if he de deals one normally. I think that's... I think that's upped. Oh yeah, that's upped. Good old Mario! Always fighting! You're a four to my side! But today, your pathetic little attacks won't beat me! Take a look at this! Look what I stole from the Star Haven! It's the Star Rod! This fine piece of work has the power to grant any wish in the whole wide world! And when I use the Star Rod to increase my strength, even you can't beat me, Mario! Oh yeah, this is my Von Karma voice. Honestly, considering it's an N64 emulator, that's running pretty smoothly. How do you like that, Mario? Yeah, he's gonna deal... That's no more damage than you did last turn. Okay, if it lags during the battle, though, that might be difficult to get the action commands. <laughs> Is that all you've got? How sad! You'd best take some vitamins, because that didn't hurt at all. Yep, just as I expected. Mario's no match for the new me. It's not even worth my time to toy with you anymore, Mario. It's time to end this. Here we go, Mario. Good night. Okay, so they, they shortened this battle a bit. Okay, well, that's definitely more damage. <laughs> oh no, Mario, get up, please. <laughs> oh yeah, yes, I did it. I finally did it. I beat my old rival, Mario. Yes! Congratulations on your victory, your viciousness. That's why you're the king. As long as I have the Star Rod, everything I wish will come true. No one can stop me now. Well, 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 I guess I might as well get rid of Mario. He's no good to anyone now, that's for sure. No, oh, how could you? Luckily, Mario's made of paper and thus can't die. Oh no, Mario! Dun 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 <laughs> Paper Mario promo yeah. I wonder if they just literally edited this still image in the game to add the promo to it. Prologue! A plea from the stars. You know it's a hard hack when the tutorial battle one-shots you. <laughs> yeah. I mean, Bowser in the regular game also can one-shot you. But he just takes a few turns to actually use that move. But it's definitely hard. It's definitely more powerful than this. <laughs> I wonder if they just double damage from all enemies. It'll be interesting to see. The Star Spirits! Oh, thank heavens! He's been gravely injured, but I think he'll recover. But Bowser has the Star Rod! Now he's mightier than Mario! It's hopeless! All is lost! <laughs> Everybody just- Oh no, that, that's the Koopa Koopa voice. Everybody just calm down. As long as we keep it together, there's always hope. Now. Our fates are in Mario's hands. We must try to revive him. Gather round, everyone. Send Mario your power. I don't know how to do Goompa percent, but maybe maybe Goompa is a legit partner in this game. That would be great. Oh, oh man, what if in promo you get Goompa as your permanent partner instead of Goombario? That would be hilarious. Whew. That's it. That's all we can do right now. Mario, please get up. Please. I back. It took me an embarrassingly long time to realize that Goombaria's has a bow. I thought that was always her hairdo. So, yeah, that took embarrassingly long to figure out. It so really sounded like something fell around here. Oh! Who could that be? This red shirt, this hat, and this mustache. 
You know, this really looks like the one and only Mario! It couldn't be, could it? The real Mario? Hey! Hey, wake up! Come on! Up and at him! Oh no! He won't wake up! I love how there's like one family of Goombas that actually likes Mario, and that's it. <laughs> oh no! What am I gonna do? Dad! Goomba! Goombario! And that's why I don't try to do girls' voices. Uh, Mar Marty, you should refresh then, if you're if the screen is stuck for you. Mario, can you hear me, Mario? I'm Eld Star, a star spirit. I have something very important to tell you. Wait, no, wait, stop skipping this. It's okay, bro. I've played the game before. <laughs> Go to Shooting Star Summit, blah, blah, blah. <laughs> oh, thank goodness there's a Toad house here. Oh, thank goodness Toad doesn't mind me using his one and only bed in his house. Oh, Mario! I'm so happy to see you awake! You haven't opened your eyes for days and days! Everyone's been worried sick, and I've had to sleep on the ground! This place? This is Goomba Village! It's a tiny village that's just west of Toad Town! The only residents are me and a single family of Goombas! Oh, you have to watch ads, Marty? Hmm. Now, I'm gonna try something. Uh... Can I make Marty a mod here? I actually don't know how to make people mods. I don't have any mods. Um, I bet you have to do an actual like hotkey in Twitch. Okay, well, time for Artie's Google. We're gonna Google how <laughs> Twitch make mod. <laughs> oh, it's that easy. Oh. Let's try... Okay, Marty, you are now a mod. I'm not sure if that cuts ads for you or not, but I hope so. Regardless, I, I think I think you have deserve, you've earned the right to be a mod. <laughs> ah, the Goombas in this family are just the nicest folks you'll ever meet! They're the ones who found you unconscious in the forest and carried you here to get better! How did they do that without the arms? <laughs> huh? A star with a mustache? You're saying a star told you to go to Shooting Star Summit? Well, I think so! I kinda skipped through that text. <laughs> no, I saw nothing like that, and I sure didn't see anyone come in or out of the house! I wonder, Mario, maybe you just had a dream? Maybe... <laughs> Although maybe not! It could have been some sort of a message from a star spirit! They live in Star Haven! Wow, why is it lagging in the Toad House for all things? Shooting Star Summit is the nearest place to Star Haven, so that would make sense! Oh man, my Toad voice is terrible. Who knows? In any case, I'm glad to see you've recovered! I know the Goombas would be happy if you paid them a visit! Oh boy! Later, loser! I don't think I start with anything. Um. Well, that took a long time to open. Good grief! Oh, land sakes! Mario, so nice to meet you! My! I'm so glad you woke up! I can't tell you how worried I was when you were just lying there asleep for so long! You were there for like, seven days straight, and the toad had to sleep on the floor! <laughs> oh my gosh. She's got teeth, but also like, really tiny lips. I've never noticed that before. Like, she's got really tiny lips in between her buck teeth. Like, what? <laughs> Hey, Goombario! Hey, Mario! I'm Goombario! I'm your biggest fan! Uh, you don't know what this means for me to meet you! Seriously! Okay, okay, okay. C calm down, bro. <laughs> Mario, you look better! I'm so glad! I was really worried about you because you were lying there in the forest and you didn't open your eyes all at all the whole time! And N64 emulators hate the Paper Mario pause menu. Is it like how they, the emulators hate the pick the, the, pick the box in Majora? <laughs> oh, they're not teeth, they're old lady glasses. Those are some very low-down old lady glasses, but, I mean, I, I guess that would make more sense. <laughs> now I can't unsee that. Howdy, Mario! Feeling better? Feel free to rest in our house. Do you have a bed? 
Oh, uh, no, only the Toad has a bed. We we can't build a bed. We don't have the arms for it. You what? Y you have to leave right now. Oh, shooting Star Summit. Something important to do, no bed out. Well, I believe that the summit's near Toad Town. Uh, you'll have to wait a bit. I have to fix the gate before I can head out to the east. That earthquake the other day really did a job on it. Did you feel that quake? Shoot, I thought the sky was falling. Just relax and don't worry. I'll have this fixed in Jiffy. Actually, should I give him the Flanders voice? <laughs> He kind of looks like the Goomba version of Flanders. <laughs> okay, yeah. Goomba has the old lady glasses. I've been out there pickling mushrooms to support the family business. Would you like to buy one? They're 20 coins each? What? <laughs> Is that an... Oh, picking, not pickling. 20 coins for a mushroom? What a ripoff. Oh, all right, dear. Just let me know if you change your mind later. That's cool, though. That actually... Am I going to need that? That kind of worries me, because there's normally not a shop in Goomba Village. And now there is! Are we going to need that? Is the Goomba King actually going to be, like, tough? Oh, you startled me. Hmm, yes, Mario, isn't it? So you've awakened at last. Good. Knew you'd pull through. Call me Goompa. I'm the Goomba grandfather, so I'm Goompa. Oh, I'm sorry, but would you mind giving me the details later? I'm pretty busy fixing the veranda. Jeez, everyone's busy? Everyone's too busy. Also, the Goomba family has no beds. The only person in this village... By the way, village of two, like, buildings is the Toad, and I was sleeping in it. So there have been no beds in this village for the last, like, week. <laughs> oh, Mario! My dad was looking for you! He said to tell you that he finished fixing the gate! So I guess now you can travel east of Toad Town and shoot Star Summit, huh? Yeah, yeah, oh boy. Oh, boy. <laughs> Hi, diddly-ho, neighbor! Who? what a job! Sorry to have kept you waiting. The gate is finally fixed. If you take this road straight ahead, you'll eventually reach Toad Town, the home of the Princess Peach's castle. <laughs> I believe that the Shooting Star Summit is just beyond there. It's too bad you can't stay. I feel like I just met you, but duty calls I know. Come back and visit if you can. <laughs> Best of luck, Mario! <laughs> This game, the emulator is like, oh no, animations. <laughs> ah, my instincts were correct. Mario, I can't believe you're on your feet after taking such a beating from King Bowser. You're a hardy one, all right. I was smart to come here and check on you. Well, what? What's that, Daddy? What's that weird flying thing? Weird? You rude little, I am a beautiful Koopa with a beautiful name, Cammy Koopa. Hmph, <laughs> I wish I had time to teach you a lesson, brat, but no. Mario, hear this! It is useless for you to try to save Princess Peach. Ridiculous. Laughable. As you have seen, King Bowser is more powerful than even you can deal with this time. Here's a gift from him. <laughs> and then she creates an Ultra Hammer block. <laughs> we did say promo, you gotta use glitches to get past this block. <laughs> <laughs> Mario, you will kneel and weep when you see the wonderful changes King Bowser's made. Your world is ours now. <laughs> um, I just fixed that gate. Nobody say gate to me. Cammy Koopa, that's the fiend. Did you hear what she said about the princess? It didn't sound good. I ho hope nothing's happened to her. This is turning into Mr. Fenderbender's voice. What? Well, what? Bowser went and kidnapped Princess Peach? Again? <laughs> oh, unbelievable! And now you have to go to Shooting Star Summit and help save her, right? Uh, that could be a problem. Dad, we gotta do something! Nobody- only Mario can save the princess. Everyone else is incompetent. Mm. Oh, here's an idea! Maybe we can break this block with Goompa's big hammer. <laughs> I mean, we don't have the arms to use it, but Mario does. <laughs> I think he's using it now to fix the veranda. Go ask him for it, will ya? Yeah, sure. Uh-oh. Game's lagging more and more. But then occasionally it just completely stops, so... Hmm, that seems a little strange. I don't remember that last time. <laughs> Yahoo! Oh, no! <laughs> Luckily, paper can't take fall damage. Hey, bro. Oh, my back, hmm? Who's that? Is that you, Mario? Wow, you fell from, like, 
200 feet and you're an old man and you still live. Congratulations. I remember a great crashing noise and the veranda collapsed and I fell. Did you fall too? Just stepped out into the door into thin air, did you? Well, we're both okay. Problem is, we can't get home because that block is in the way. What if the other Goomba family members, like, also go to the veranda? They're gonna fall too. This block, this block shouldn't be here. Well, this is a problem for us. Huh? A hammer? Oh, of course! Um, where did it go? I was using it to fix the veranda, so it's likely around here somewhere. Hmm, nowhere to be seen. I guess it must have fallen over somewhere over there. Mario, we better go look for it. <laughs> In this hack, Goompa doesn't let you take the hammer. He has to use the hammer. So you have to find your own. That would be funny. The hammer's gotta be somewhere close by. It looks like this. Yeah, 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 I know. in that bush. You found the hammer! Mario can do the hammer attack now, and you can break yellow blocks and hit trees. Oh yes, that's the hammer. Good. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I know how to use the hammer. A blunk. A coin. I wonder if there are new invisible blocks in the pro mode. That would be cool. I'm down for more changes other than just inflated stats, but I just... <laughs> they should be good changes. Okay, this is... this is getting ridiculous. I'm gonna go into my OBS settings and reduce some things and hopefully reduce the lag. Because that worked so great for Majora's Mask, right? Alright, let's do a 1500-bit rate. Maybe that'll help out a little bit. The dolly! Oh, that's the dolly the Goombaria lost. Can we keep it with us? Can we give it to somebody else later in the game? Hmm, well, we found the hammer, so I guess we should head for home. Oh yeah, first real boss battle. Youch! Who are you guys? This is my playground, idiots! Nobody sets foot in here without my permission! Nobody! Prepare to start crying at the feet of Master Junior Troopa! Mario, this is Junior Troopa. He's the boss of the neighborhood gang. A bit of a bully, obviously. He's more bark than bite. You can beat him easily. Just boost yourself up and don't take any lip. I'll stay right here behind you and watch your progress. I wonder if this battle will be different. We don't have action commands yet, so probably not. Oh, excellent. Good move. Go on. Yep, he's already dealing more damage. I don't like how it's lagging in the battles. That's gonna actually be difficult. Uh, I'm just getting warmed up! Um, are we going to die in this battle? You can use glitches to eat the doll in front of Goombaria. What? I'm not surprised, but wow. Mario, you've almost got him. Keep it up. Go on. Alright, you asked for it. Say hello to Junior Troopa's special attack. FULL POWER! Uh, is he going to kill us? Um, unless he has less HP in this mode, he's going to kill us. Apparently he has less HP in this mode. Alright, I'll take it. Mario, that was wonderful fighting! You got star points! You get star points every time you beat an enemy. Every time you save up a hundred star points, you'll go up a level. Always try to get points. Shoot! I was winning too! I'll be back, Mario! I mean it! I'll be back! Yeah, n no joke. <laughs> he comes back so much. Well, he definitely beat us up a bit more than last time, but it's still an automated battle. Oh my gosh. Don't do this. Apparently spinning is not a good idea. Oh yeah, we got an item. Yay, thank goodness there was still a mushroom in that tree. Thank goodness these are still free. <laughs> if you hit this block, your HP will fully recover. Good. And we don't have to pay for it like in Thousand Year Door. Oh, wow. We can see the seams a lot more easily on the emulator. <laughs> I think that fire flower is going to be very useful. 
I mean, it's already useful in the base game, but... Hitting all enemies is gonna be very nice. Heads up, Mario, I see bad Goombas ahead. They're loyal to Bowser. You mean, that's, I think, I think the bad Goombas are the rule and not the exception, bro. All right, let's see how tough go regular old Goombas are in this. Okay, they still only have two HP. Not a fan of the lag, but we're going to work with it. Because I really don't know how to reduce it. Okay, so regular Goombas still only have 2 HP. I guess that's nice. Maybe it was just the bosses that got buffed. I guess we get to see if they're more powerful. Okay, they definitely pack a bigger punch. Bean mod does not stop ads after reloading. Oh. Well, that stinks. There we go. I really hope there's a way to reduce lag for the later fights, because if the if the game starts lagging during the battles and then stops lagging at various times, that's going to make action commands really annoying. Hey, Mobius, how's it going? Uh, we, we, you only missed, like, the intro and tutorial stuff, which we're still a part of. Alright, we're, we're definitely going after the star pieces. For sure, the star pieces get us some really nice badges. Alright, back to Goomba Village. Never worry, kids! Mario and I are alive. <laughs> Thank goodness Goomba had the key to that. Mm Goompa, where have you been? I looked outside and wow, both you and the veranda were just plain gone. <laughs> Goompa, I was very, very worried about you, really worried. Sorry, kids, I apologize. I didn't mean to make you fret, just take it easy now. I'm back safe and sound. Despite it being hard mode. Like, there's nothing happening on screen right now. Why is it lagging? No. Before I forget, I've decided to give you something, Mario. Wait here a minute. Is it going to be the same badge that he normally does? Huh? Hey, that dolly that you've, lo that you've got. That's the one Goombaria lost. She was looking all over for it. Would you give it back to her? No. Aw, oh, that's just mean, Mario. I guess you could just give it back when you're done with it. I was talking like that with as Goombario because the game was lagging. <laughs> you always seem to beat up your enemies. Do you work out? At the gym every day. I study self-defense by reading books and by the masters and listening to Dad and Goompa. Oh, and I also exercise every day so I can be strong like you. It's starting to show too. I'm getting big muscles in your brain. <laughs> Not randomized pro mode, which means tougher enemies and bosses. <laughs> yeah, Goombarium's head is hard as a rock now. Hehe. <laughs> when he does his head bonk move, it really, really hurts. Oh, be quiet, Goombaria. You're embarrassing me. Of course it is true. Sorry to have kept you waiting, Mario. I'm waiting for ice traps to appear in here. <laughs> it's okay, Goompa. We were just rapping with Mario. Oh, rapping, huh? Sorry, I wanted to give this to Mario. Okay, it's still the power jump badge. Cool. This is called a badge. If you wear this, you'll be able to do power jump. But listen up. You better listen to the badge tutorial. Oh, I did not want to do that. Now we gotta wait ten seconds for the pause menu to open up. I, I wanted to skip that. Now remember, you need FP to use these. Yeah, 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 blah, blah, blah. By the way, Mario, I heard from Goomba. You're taking it upon yourself to rescue the princess from Bowser's clutches. Would you like to buy some mushrooms? I don't think I can afford them. Oh yeah, Mario could be Bowser with one hand tied behind his back. Hush now, Goombario. Mario, please take this hammer. It should serve you well. If I were just a bit younger, I'd accompany you on your trip and I'd have done some damage. The years have started to weigh on me, though. I tell you, this lower back pain. Adventure! You're so lucky! 
Princess Rescue, it is so cool! I really want to be an adventurer too someday! Me too! Oh, here's an idea, Goombario. Perhaps the timing is perfect. You're no longer a child, and evil times are upon us. I'm sure Mario will agree. You should accompany Mario. Uh, do I get to say in this? <laughs> what? Really? May I go, Goombong? May I really go? You should be asking the guy who you would be going with. <laughs> yes! Oh, yeah, Mario, you won't regret this. I didn't say yes. <laughs> Goombario, join your party. Use Down C to have him tell you about people, places, and things. And he's also helpful during battles. He can jump, too. Way to go, Goombario. I did not agree to this. <laughs> Goombario, <laughs> Mario, I know Goombario will prove to be a worthy companion. <laughs> well, I think it's about time for my nap. I'll be in the house. Goodbyes have a way of making this old Goomba get weepy. This is so cool, Mario, let's go! But wait, your HP looks a little low. Maybe you want to take a rest at the Toad House. Good thinking, Toad. Yeah, those don't look like old lady glasses. Those look like teeth. She only put lipstick on part of her lips. Definitely up equipping that power jump badge. Getting that Goomba Nut. Alright, we better take a snooze. Ah, uh, the, the toads. Uh, yes, yeah, yeah. I just want to sleep in your bed. Um, okay. I have no problem with that. <laughs> thank goodness the thank goodness you don't have to pay for fiends like this in the in the first game. Hoppa de doop dee da! Yippee! Please take care of Gumbario. That dolly you are holding is mine. I know it. Give it back, pretty please. Oh no, this is my uh, Princess Peach Voodoo doll. It's very different. You meanie Mario. <laughs> All right, okay. Now we'll give it back. Oh, thank you! You're sweet now! <laughs> you can have this! It glitters in the sun! Yay, yeah, Star Piece! But the real reason is for the kiss. <laughs> Gubario's like, Eww, yuck! <laughs> there we go! <laughs> oh, there we go! Problem solved, neighbor, you know? <laughs> Alright, see, see ya, Flanders. Alright. Beware of Goombas! Like, on this side. <laughs> hey, Mario! Uh, I really want to do- uh, Yeah, 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 yeah. I know how to fight, bro. I don't think fighting has really changed all that much in this hack. When am I going to get sound commands for my channel? I've tried to get them to work, but I can't figure out how to get them to work. As soon as, soon as I can figure out how I can get- Like, have the audience, like, input a command to play a sound, I will. And I have the first sound that I'm implementing. The first sound that I'm implementing is Ansem yelling "Submit!" from Kingdom Hearts. No, no question. <laughs> oh yeah, we should tattle on these guys. Uh, that's a Goomba. Yeah, we know about Goombas. Just show me their HP. I'm curious if it's literally just every enemy has double attack power in this, because that's what it's been like so far. With a few modifications. Oh, great. Maybe fighting every enemy that we see is not going to turn out so well. It's quite possible. <laughs> Boom! You can't hammer the, the you can't hammer paragumbas. Easy as pie. Which is funny. Funny that that's a saying because pies are kind of difficult to make. That's a Paragoomba, blah, 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 blah. We in danger, boys. <laughs> this ain't good. I did get the extent, the Twitch extension for sound commands, but I... Actually, wait, I want to try something. No, that didn't do anything.
I think there's a heart block uh, before too long. Oh boy. Oh my gosh, why? This lag is, like, unbearable. Alright, we're tattling on the Spiky Goomba. Spiky Goomba has massively inflated attack power, so we're having Goombario do that first. <laughs> Man, these Goombas are dangerous! Like, especially because we can't do the action guards. Once we get the Lucky Star, things will get simultaneously a lot easier and a lot more difficult. Thank goodness enemies are dropping hearts, though. Close Call Badge! Yes, we want to equip that. This is gonna suck every time we get a new badge and have to equip it, and it's like, Oh, you will be prepared. Close Call's gonna be really useful in this mode, though. Eat a mushroom to regain your energy! Yay! Waboom! That is not good. Okay, um... Yeah, we're actually gonna run away from that. Because I'm not using my Fire Flower on that, and we will die <laughs> if we don't. Okay, here we go. We'll get the heart first, and then we'll fight him. Because I am, I am not using a Fire Flower on common enemies. I'm saving that for... I'll probably end up using it on the Goomba Bros or the Goomba King. Wouldn't have this lag if you played Star Wars Episode 1 Racer like you requested? Um... That's true. And you know what? You know what, Marty? Star Wars Episode 1 Racer... That did win. That did tie for second place in the uh, polls. I'm gonna use power jump. It did tie for second place in the polls. So, and it's also a very short game. So that probably will be streamed pretty soon, regardless. <laughs> I don't know if online pod racers actually works. <laughs> I'm also not very good at it. I literally didn't know you could drift in that game until recently. All right, we're at, the top, we're at our top HP and FP, and now it's time for the first real fight. Hey, hey, hold it right there! Yeah, you suspicious guy, don't move! Ha, <laughs> you Mario! I knew it! You can't go past here, you're a big Mr. Big Shot. It's a direct order from the Goomba King. That's right, Goomba King is the king of, like, what, two Goombas? I'm sorry, but the only way is through the Goomba Bros. That's me, Red Goomba, and my brother, Blue Goomba. Let's get him, Blue Goomba. Oh yeah, let's do it, my red brother. Okay. So now I'm gonna start by tattling on him. He's Blue Goomba. This is Blue Goomba. He's the younger brother of the notorious Goomba Bros. Yeah, he's one of the Goomba King's men. They're not actually listing off their attack power in this mod. Okay, he still only has six HP. Okay, that's good. So I'm going to let's see. I think Goom I think Red Goomba only has seven. I'm just gonna power jump Blue Goomba. Two power jumps will take him out. <laughs> Mario! How'd you like some of this? Okay, they both only... Okay. <laughs> yeah, they're still gonna be pretty easy. We just gotta use power jumps. Goodbye, Blue Goomba. Blue! Blue Goomba! I will have my little brother! You'll pay for that, Mario! Will I, though? This is Red Goomba, he's the older of the Notorious, yeah, blah, blah, blah. Actually... Actually, my life is in a bit of danger. I might have to use a Mushroom for this. Yeah, I will, because I'm out of FP for that. It's going to take a few turns, so... I'm not in danger for this. I do have close call, though, so maybe we'll dodge the, an attack. It's like a, 30, a one in free chance. Booyah! How lucky! Thank you, close call. This game should not be lagging. It's not that diff it's not that complex of a game. Okay. For safety's sake, I have to eat a mushroom here. 
that's okay. Maybe the shops will have inflated prices. That would be fun. I guess this is why. I guess this is why uh, Guma is selling mushrooms for 20 coins because you do pretty much need a mushroom. You do need an item to get for this battle, or a lot of level grinding. The only other programs I have running in the background are programs that I have to have running in the background in order for this to work. Ah! I'll let you go for now. I have the emulator, I've got OBS, I've got my driver for the controller that I'm using, and then I've got Twitch chat open. And that's it. Wait a second. We gotta go back and heal. Ah, uh, I love how fast N64 games can save. That's a fake mushroom. I wonder if... It, okay, yeah. So that's gonna turn around... Okay, it doesn't turn around into anything else. I was like, is it gonna turn around into a tougher enemy? Goomba King Fortress ahead! It probably is I have emu my emulator settings set too high. But even so, like... Again, I'm running this from a laptop, so... Maybe it just doesn't like the M64 emulator very much. King Goomba, help us! Mario beat us up! Those are his only subjects. <laughs> hey, look, Mario! See that building over there? I'm pretty sure that there used to be a bridge on the other side. I wonder what happened to it. Oh my gosh, the music's getting butchered from the lag. So, Mario, it's true you've made it this far. I respect you for that. Unfortunately, this is as far as you'll ever get, because I, the great and powerful King Goomba, will see to it that you advance no farther. You heard that, Mario? No farther! Not one step! Are you scared, little man? <laughs> yeah, you're scared, all right. You want to say you're sorry? Wow, that King Goomba is really huge! But I'm sure he's no match for you, though, Mario. Let's get him! Ready to meet my wrath, Mario? You'd better be! <laughs> no, Goombario, I don't see this giant building in front of me. Beat him up, King Goomba! We've got your back! Leave him to me! Hey, Mario, I think maybe we gotta take out the Goomba Bros first, don't you think? They must be pretty weak since you just finished beating them up back there. Oh, look, bleh! They got a lot more HP back. Okay, well. Gotta hit the Goom Nut Tree first. This is a good opening attack. Alright, that dealt more damage than it usually does, but this is bad. The Goomba Bros are still alive. I... You... We're taking out Blue Goomba first, so we, we're not taking that extra damage from this attack. <laughs> And that also deals a lot more damage. Oh boy. Is the Goomba King just way more powerful than you? This is actually legitimately difficult. No, Marty. In Paper Mario N64, you can't actually do the action commands like the double jump until after you get the Lucky Star item. I'm going to assume that only that one of the Goomba King's attacks actually deals four damage on it as everyone's only deal two or three, so... Here's hoping we don't die from the Goomba King's attack! And he can also only do that Goom Nut attack once per battle, so... Okay, that's what I thought. That's what I thought. Alright, unfortunately we're gonna have to eat our last mushroom. This is good! I'm liking the difficulty here. Alright. Now we're gonna tattle. It's the Goomba King! He's really big and really powerful! Yeah, they're not actually listing their attack power in this anymore. They've, like, patched that out of the the hack. Which is a shame, because it would actually be useful to know how powerful they are. Doggone it. Stupid game lag, stop it. Cool, we did not need the fire flower. Bye-bye. <laughs> 
No, they don't have extra HP yet. So that, that's interesting. All right. So here's the thing. We don't have enough badges so that BP would really be useful. We only have power jump. I actually might go for HP. I think I'm actually going to go for HP first, just because we're, we're actually surprisingly coming close to dying a lot. W what? How could I lose? Yeah, I knew we could do it. Cool victory. Oh, yeah. Let's get ourselves our star piece. Red Goomba, you're positive that you hid the switch well, right? Of course, King Goomba! I hid it in the grass outside the fortress! OUTSIDE THE- YOU IDIOT! You didn't hide it in here! Mario will find it for sure! Oh, do you think- you know, you might be right. King Goomba, maybe we ought to try to trick Mario before he tries to. No such luck today, friends. Boom! Uh, Mario, uh, good- good fight and all that, but I must warn you, however. If you happen to find a strange switch somewhere, you should definitely not press it. It's dangerous. Understand? You what? You already pressed it? No! Who designed this fortress, Doofenshmirtz? <laughs> Every fortress needs to have a self-destruct button, Perry the Platypus! <laughs> I like how the windows are paper. <laughs> oh my gosh. I'm gonna have to look into emulator settings to minimize this lag. I guess it's not really self-destructing, it's just it turning back into the bridge it used to be. Bye, Goomba King. See you in the victory parade at the end. Look! The bridge! Now we can cross it and continue our journey! Alright! I love your enthusiasm, Goombario. The Transformer Fortress. <laughs> Give me that coin. Wubloonk! Oh, thank goodness we get a new health fulfilling item. Super Shrooms are going to be very useful in this playthrough. I think we're going to really need to use items and badges to their full potential for this mode, which I'm very happy about. But yeah, we can continue for a bit longer. I still don't want these streams to be much longer than an hour and a half. Again, it's supposed to be small, like, <laughs> bite-sized streams for the cer certain weekdays. But we can definitely continue for a bit more. We can at least get the lucky star. Mighty King Mouser, I've been looking for you. A reporter of evilness, Mario defeated the Goomba King. He, she, he's heading for Toad Town now. What? Unbelievable! What was the Goomba King thinking? I used the Star Rod to make him a king because he begged me! And Mario whips him so easily? What a wimp! Uh, Kami Koopa, you are sure that Mario can never defeat us, right? Well, please, please revile this. Try to be calm. King Goomba was a small time. I had a feeling he'd fail. It doesn't matter, because you, while you hold the Star Rod, you're definitely invincible, especially on Pro Mode. You could beat Mario with one claw tied behind your back. And once we can get to Bombette in, uh, before 9.30 my time, which is a half hour away, then probably not. <laughs> yes, yes, very good. <laughs> I do love Bombat, though. By the way, Kirby Koopa, those star spirits we're cap we captured don't have any way of giving Mario their power, do they? Please don't worry yourself. Each is held separately, and each is carefully guarded by your hand-picked subjects. Why don't we just have all the star spirits here with me? Actually, that's a much better idea. But then Mario can't beat us. I know! <laughs> Uh, what, that would be a fun game, Bowser. Even Mario can't save all seven of the star spirits. Hmm. <clears throat> Who's the closest star spirit to Mario? It's the one at Koopa Bros Fortress, right? If Mario somehow reaches there, could the Koopa Bros defeat him? King Bowser, you mustn't worry. Time for the best characters, everyone. Hiya! Also, best music. When it's not being ruined by game lag. 
Here come the Koopa Bros! Uh huh! Oh yeah! We're the coolest of the cool! Psst! Kami Koopa, are you sure these guys can get the job done? That Goomba King was gigantic, and even he couldn't beat Mario! Psha! Get real, King Bowser! Yeah, the Goomba King was huge, but he was a total Wimpola! We're nothing like him! See, what we've got going on is the power of teamwork. Together, we can put the hurt on Mario in seconds flat. Excellent! That's the spirit! Sell it, Goopa Bros! Show our king that special attack you do so well! Yes, ma'am! Ready, everybody? Oh! Oh! That... This is... Oh! How'd you like it, King Bowser? How was it? Oh yeah! Excellent! Really! I'm not easily impressed, either! Mario won't have a chance if you finish him with that attack. Yeah, I, the Koopa Bros legit scare me in pro mode. They're gonna be really tough. We'll take him, King Bowser! Uh, by the way, Koopa Bros, about the captured Star Spirit I'm locking up in your fortress. Who's guarding it right now? Uh, nobody, sir. Uh, you know, we're here, and so... YOU IDIOTS! USE YOUR HEADS! GET BACK TO THE FORTRESS AND GUARD THAT STAR SPIRIT! I don't care if they're blatant Ninja Turtles ripoff. I'm, I'm calling them a Ninja Turtles homage, and they're cooler. <laughs> Bring Pow Blocks and Fire Flowers. That's what I'm gonna do. I'm more worried for when they stack up together and attack before you can get a chance to knock them over. That's gonna deal, I think, 8 damage. Which is no joke. Hammer throw badge! Which really isn't that good at the beginning of the game, but I have, I have its uses later. Alright, Toad Town! Mario, I'm glad you're okay! The town is in an uproar! The princess kidnapped! The very castle uprooted! It's Bedlam! I really don't know what we can do about all this! Please, Mario, save her highness! I'm actually going to go home and take a nap! <laughs> I wonder what my brother Mario is doing right now. Whoa, Mario! It's you! Good to see you! And you're alright! After all that castle craziness, I was really worried about you. I ran outside just as the earthquake started, so I managed to escape in time. Oh, and who are you? I'm Goobario! It's nice to meet you! I see. Great, just great. You're on an exciting adventure with Mario. Talk about unfair. <laughs> see, someone has to look after the house, so I can't leave. Oh, well, take care of Mario, okay? I want Mar oh, Luigi as one of your partners. I know he would literally just be a second Mario, but that's why I want him. Mario, <laughs> they're good. <laughs> Whoosh! Let's have Goombario take care of our house. I'm sure he'd love that. <laughs> Alright, let's see if the shop has inflated prices. Um, slightly. Not by much, though. Fire flowers are still the same price. Fright jars are 15 coins. Why would anyone buy a fright jar? Actually, that might be helpful in these boats. Yeah, I'm noticing the mushrooms are a little more pricey, but fire flowers are still only 10 coins, so... I'm kind of happy with that. Let's see if Rust Tea is actually any different in this. Oh, salutations! You are Mario, are you not? Of course I know who you are. I'm the wise toad Rust Tea. Pleasure meeting you. As you can probably tell, I love books and read all the time. Because I'm so well read, I know all sorts of interesting facts. Whenever you visit me, I'm happy to share all the knowledge I have with you. Are you talking to me because you crave knowledge that only my intellect can provide? Then how about this? So just told that far away at the very top of the sky there exists a star- Yeah, I know that. Okay, I don't think he's any different. I didn't know if he would, like, give different advice because you're playing a hack. Give me that star piece. I need as many of those as I can get my hands on. Okay, oh yeah, that's right. Rolf doesn't open his bad shop till after World 1. 
Oh look! <laughs> Friendly toads! <laughs> oh thank goodness. It's dangerous out there. I wouldn't go. Yeah, you shouldn't go. Nope, no go. Sorry, but no. These are like what toads would look like if they went golf. Oh my gosh. It's running at like an eighth of the speed sometimes. Wait a little. Uh, that's new! That is not there in the regular game. Um, so there's a warp pipe that's gonna appear here. That is intriguing. I'm actually, I'm interested in that. This is... What? This is also different. They made new maps? Whoa, this is totally new. Yeah, this is where... What? Post-game super bosses is your guess for, for that pipe. This is awesome! This is so cool! Maybe you could fight Luigi? Oh, don't get my hopes up. That would be amazing. Did they put in their own super bosses? That would be so sick. Maybe you fight your partners. Alright, let's go for the plot exposition. Welcome, Mario. We've been waiting. Yeah, I'm just... I think I'm gonna just skip through all this. This is just boring. Plot. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Bowser is the star ride. We're, they're the seven star spirits. They're trapped in seven different places. If we get them all, then we get, get a power that can override Bowser's. And they're also very weak. You can tell how much the game is lagging based on how slow the music is going compared to normal. Princess is in danger, we can save her. Oh yeah, we get to play as, as Mafia Peach! Oh, this is gonna be great! <laughs> Mario's probably hurt. Everyone's in prison. The Mushroom Kingdom will be destroyed if things will continue the way they're going. Something must be done. If only somebody could help me. Did you just say somebody to help you? Cause Keen Bowser's here! <laughs> My dear Princess Peach, how are you doing this fine day? It's no use waiting for Mario this time, my dear. We're so high up above the sky right now. Even Mario doesn't have a chance of reaching us up here. You know, Princess, as long as I have this star rod, no one in the Mushroom Kingdom can touch me. You know the power that grants everyone's wishes? It's mine! Isn't that just wonderful? <laughs> Imagine what it's like down in your kingdom. Your subjects must be so upset because their wishes aren't being granted. Oh, how delightful! They deserve it for the way they've treated us Koopas over the years. If you, you know, want anything, all you have to do is ask me, Princess. I could grant wishes. Of course, I'll only grant requests that I like. Anyway, think about it. If you want, like, a cinnamon roll or something, just, just say the word. You take care of Princess Peach, enjoy your stay here. <laughs> you watch yourself, Princess. You'd better not cause trouble. Blah -ha -ha -ha. Oh, please. If only somebody could help me. Huh? Uh, what? <laughs> Thank you. 
Hello, Princess Peach. Nice to meet you. My name is Twink. <laughs> Should I do that voice? Probably not. But you're you're a star kid, aren't you? How'd you get here? I came from Star Haven to grant your wish. It's our job to grant wishes, you know. No, oh, you can, because I wish that somebody would help me. Yes, of course. Oh, that's just great. Thank you so much for coming. Here's my wish. Go right back and take the star rod back from Bowser, okay? Think you can do it? Uh, sorry. That's a little too much for a non-star like me. Maybe one of the honorable star spirits from Starhaven could grant a wish like that. I'm so sorry. Uh, please ask for something easy, something a s small star could do. I, 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 no, I can't do that. <laughs> then, can you take me away from here? Every one of my castles has been captured, and I have to save them all as soon as possible. Yeah, I'll just do my regular twin voice. Oh, I'm sorry, I can't grant that wish either, I'm afraid. Actually, I just got called up here from to the sky a day ago, so I can't do big wishes yet. If I were a more splendid star, maybe I could actually help. No, it's alright. Don't be sad, Twink. Mario will definitely do something to save us all. He's probably coming right now. Oh, Twink, do you think you can find Mario? I want you to give this to him. <laughs> he really needs to know how to use action commands. This is a lucky star, isn't it? Okay, I'll do it! Princess Peach, I'll fly to the Mushroom Kingdom as quick as I can! Actually, this is the Goombario voice, isn't it? I only can do, like, five voices, sorry. Oh, wait, Twink. Wait one second. Can you also... Please tell Mario that... I'm fine and he shouldn't worry. Okay, can you tell him that? Of course! I'll tell your, him your exact words, Princess Peach, definitely! Now, don't despair. I'll be back soon, so stay safe while I return, okay? I got a deep voice. I can't do h high, higher-pitched characters. Mario, where are you? <laughs> hey, Prince Dusk. Ah, no worries about being late. There's still a bit of the stream left. Around 15 minutes. Okay, I gotta explore this area more, because, like, are you kidding me? They added more to Shooting Star Summit. It's amazing. This is insane. Oh my gosh! This is so cool! I can't believe they actually made new parts to Shooting Star Summit. Whoa. Sparkle! That's such a cool effect! Oh my gosh, so this is where you take your partners. <gasps> oh, this is so cool! This is so cool. Whoa! What? Is this a bonus dungeon? Oh, I'm going in right now. If there are enemies, I'm going to book it, but... Guys, you have no idea how insanely surreal it is for me to see, like, new locations in this game. <sighs> this looks so professional, too. This looks like it literally belongs in the game. Which I know that's, like, the intention, but... Oh my gosh, stop lagging! You guys are hearing this music, right? The music is literally running. It was like literally running at a tenth of the speed. This might be the super boss zone, like a room where you refight bosses or something. That's possible. Well, it doesn't look like I can do any of the things here. I should save. I should save. I don't want to replay the peach part again if I end up running into a super powerful enemy and dying immediately. Gosh, are you kidding me, game? This room is big, but still, come on, you're ruining, like, the amazing music. It 
is weird because it only lags periodically. That is a gorgeous backdrop. Yeah, Marty, Marty, they added new stuff to the game. Like, this is a totally new location in Shooting Star Summit. Like, Shooting Star Summit is so much bigger now. This is, this is crazy. This is crazy that they added new rooms to this. I, I wonder if that was literally made by the developers and just, like, wasn't actually included in the game. Like, it's in the game files, but they didn't actually put it in. That's a new badge right there. Looks like the group focus badge. We can't reach it yet, but... Oh, this is so cool! It would be even cooler if there, were, if there was no game lag, but... Wow. What else can I say about wow? I'm so happy to see new content added to this game. Alright. I'm assuming they didn't add any new things in the back here. Yeah, okay. Just gonna dip in here, buy, uh, get some badges from our star pieces, and dip out. Granted, I think we only have four or five star pieces, so I'm not sure if we can really get anything of value. I might just want to save up for something like Power Plus. <laughs> or Money Money. <laughs> I'm the famous Merlo! Okay, let's see what badges you got. Payoff is only one. Pretty Lucky is only five. I def Okay, so that does nothing. I do not need Chill Out. If there are more enemies that can cause status effects, and especially if the game lags, feeling fine could be very useful. Pretty lucky is pretty good. Payoff is... Payoff, I think, in the in pro mode is going to be worth it. Because we're going to take way more damage, so we'll get rich that way. Berserker? That's a new badge. Increases Mario's attack power, but makes him uncontrollable. Well, that sounds terrible. Crazed Heart. Restores HP automatically during battle at a faster rate. Mega HP Drain. Decreases Mario's attack power by 2, but restores 2 HP per turn. Flower Fanatic. During the battle, saves 2 FP every time you attack. Whoa! New badges! Okay, that's cool. Alright, I'm definitely getting payoff. Zap Tap. Yeah, Zap Tap is underrated. Or actually, I guess that depends, because I feel like half the players are like, Zap Tap is one of the best badges, and half the players are like, Zap Tap? What's that? It's a fine badge. I think it's just kind of boring, to be honest. It's like, it's like boring, but it's practical, essentially. Alright, I'm not getting any of her badges. I'm saving my, I'm saving my star pieces. As cool as the new badges would be to try out, I think a lot of those new badges won't be all that good. The Berserker badge is probably going to stink. Mega HP Drain doesn't really do it for me. Alright. I'd rather have Payoff than Close Call. Close Call it relies on random chance, and you know how much I despise random chance. Or, <laughs> you know how much I despise relying on random chance. Youch! Oh, sorry, sorry, so sorry, I'm in a huge hurry! Oh, it's... You're Mario, aren't you? Thank the stars I found you! How do you do? I'm Twink! Princess Peach asked me to bring you something! Ah, uh, yes, here it is! Here, this is it! Take it! Lucky Star! We can do action commands now. The battle is combat is actually good. That's the Lucky Star for Princess Peach. Now you can use action commands. I do not need that tutorial. Once you understand how to use the action command properly, you'll be even more powerful. Yep. Terrific! You'll be so much tougher in battle now! There you are! Of course, now, running away is not a guaranteed success, but small price to pay. What? It can't be! Were you following me? 
What a foolish star kid. I knew that if I followed you, I'd find Mario. If I defeat Mario right now, I'll be famous. I'll tell Cabby Koopa, she'll shower me with me with praise. She'll give me a raise. Hey, you're a poet. Here I come. I think that guy had three different voices. All right, Magic Koopa. What? Kablunk. This is a Magic Koopa. They use magical rods. <laughs> yeah, they don't. He doesn't tell us the stats anymore, which kind of stinks. That is not what you normally are supposed to do. Lag screwed me up for that. I do not like that. I really don't want to use my Super Shroom. I'm going to try to put him to sleep. If this fails, then we dead. Please work. Oh, thank goodness. I don't really use Sleepy Sheeps, so I was fine using it. Yeah, when they say pro mode, okay, yeah, they are not joking. This is a lot tougher. Goodbye. Wow, that was a tough fight. <laughs> Thank goodness I had a sleepy sheep with me. Thank goodness it worked. 15 star points, sweet. Well done, Mario. You're as strong as they say. I know that you'll be able to defeat Bowser. I think that was an actual Magic Koopa that we're going to encounter later in the game. I'm going to return to Princess Peach's side. I'm not strong enough to re have really help her, but at least I can tell her you're okay. Well, see, ski you later. I like how the backgrounds in this game look like paintings. It's great. Oh dear, I almost forgot to tell you the message for Princess Peach. I'm alright, so don't worry about me. That's exactly what she said. I get the feeling, though, that she's very lonely. Anyway, I'll do my best to help the both of you. But please be brave. You must save Princess Peach. That's my job. Doop, ba -doop, ba -doop, ba -doop. There he goes, back to Bowser's castle. What a brave little guy. Okay, Mario, let's get down to business. Oh no, the Magic Koopa was nowhere near that strong. Magic Koopa in the original game had like 9 HP and only 3 attack. Here he had like 15 HP and like 6 attack. Oh, Mario! Merlin was looking for you. He lives in that house with the spinning roof. He asked me to tell you to go meet him at his house. I was just about to go look for you, but here you are. It's rare for Merlin to call somebody over to his house. He's a bit eccentric. He, even when he has visitors, it's rare for him to come out of the house at all. Can I get the quick change badge early? I think quick change is going to be, like, <laughs> necessary for this game. Merlin is out. Why do you keep on knocking? I'm telling you he's out! And that, that opening the door kills Mario. What the? Why is someone sleeping in front of my house? Wait a minute. That face seems very familiar to me. Oh, maybe. No. Yes, it must be. You're Mario. I've been waiting for you. You should have come earlier. Well, you're here now. Come in. I'm gonna ha I have to, I'm gonna try my best to find a solution to this lag problem before next stream. Where to begin? My name is Merlin. I am a wizard. When I was reading the stars the other day, an oracle came to me. Well, I let's see where should I start? In short, happiness can be found even in the darkest of times if we just remember to turn on the light. Hey, Mario, are you listening to me? Oh, all right. So anyway, that is why I'm able to help you. If you get lost during your adventure, come to me. I can predict the path you should take for a small price. I wonder if the price is inflated in pro mode. Right now, your main goal must be to save Princess Peach as quickly as is humanly possible, but... According to my second sight, your path must first take you to the great fortress of the Koopa Bros. To reach the Koopa Bros fortress, head east on the road in front of the Toad House.
Is saying the boss's name before you fight them allowed or not? I've played this game many times, so... This game is also, like, 20 years old. So, I don't care about spoilers. You can spoil absolutely anything you want. Just not about this hack. If it's exclusive to this hack, please do not spoil it. But if it's just, like, talking about, like, I know the Cooper Bros were the first boss. Yeah, you can talk about that. Yeah, I don't like how it's like, oh, it runs perfectly for, like, 20 seconds, then it lags heavily for 20 seconds, then it runs perfectly for 20 seconds. Like, no, please don't. Oh, yeah, Huff and Puff, I'm, I'm scared for already. I'm excited, though, for Lava Piranha. Lava Piranha is one of my all-time favorite bosses, like, ever. So I'm hoping that he'll be, like, a really nice challenge. Let me aside, Goth Toads. Uh, you don't want to go out there. It's, it's way too dangerous. Going to Koopa Bros Fortress would be a huge mistake. Definitely. Definitely don't go. Most of all, though, you shouldn't go ask Old Man Merlin for help. That would be really bad news for us. I mean, f for you! Don't even think about it. Okay, I'll just go and ask the, the uh, post office guy for help instead. Oh my gosh. Greetings! My name's Paracarry. I deliver letters! Can you join my party early, even though you're the worst party member? Yes, hello, this is the post office. You can read any letters that arrive for you or your other party members. Please drop by now and then and check to see if you've received any mail. Well, oh, you seem to have some mail. Which would you like to read? Goombario? Letter from the Red and Blue Goombas? Eh, I'm not going to read that one. <laughs> oh, should I put the letters away? Yes. I will keep them for you. In pro mode, the letter from the Red and Blue Goombas are not like, oh, can we be friends letter? It's a threat letter. <laughs> That'd be kind of funny. <laughs> Come again? Strange toads blocking the east side of Toad Town? That shouldn't be. That's ridiculous. Such a thing has never been heard of. Never. I'll get to the bottom of this. Follow me over there. I'll see what's going on. <laughs> toads actually being aggressive and, like, blocking people's way? That's never happened in the history of the world. Wait, they're goth? No toad has ever been goth. This is ridiculous. Come on, bro. We told you not to get Merlin. I told you that you can't pass. Take off! Hmm. You aren't toads, are you? Um, we don't know what you're talking about. Yeah, what gives? Ask anyone. We're just cute, ordinary toads hanging out. Reveal your true selves. <laughs> wow, Merlin cast a lag spell? What the heck? Hmph, <laughs> just as I thought. You're the Koopa Bros. How? How'd you guess it was us? We were perfectly disguised! Shucks! Black, yellow, green! We retreat! For now. <laughs> Mario, those imposters went over, on over the, none over the Koopa Bros. Yeah, I, I could tell! <laughs> You must pursue them to their hideout, the Cooper Bros Fortress. Oh, Mario, there is one part of your fortune I haven't revealed. To get to the Cooper Bros Fortress, you'll need the help from a blue-shelled Koopa. This is a strange portent. In Koopa Village, you might find something that will clear it up. I must return home now. Thanks, bro. Alright, that seems like a pretty perfect way to end the stream here. We're right at the first chapter now. So, we can do that, uh, maybe? This might- no, there's no way we're gonna be able to do one chapter every stream. Those later chapters are long. But we might be able to do the first one in a stream, because the first chapter is pretty short. This is fun! I'm really hoping there's going to be a way I can reduce the lag for future streams, because I am- I don't know about you guys, but I do not like the lag. It screws me up in battle, and most importantly, it ruins the amazing music. This game has some of my favorite music, so I'm going to hope that we can fix that before next stream. Anyhow, 
Thanks for joining in, everybody. This is a blast. I'll definitely, uh, definitely be playing this again on Wednesday at 8 p.m. again. I'm going to try to keep these streams at around an hour and a half of all of them. I think that's a nice, nice length stream for me and for others because, well, I do have work tomorrow, so I ha I, and I'm an old man, so I, I go to bed pretty early. Anyhow, thanks for tuning in. Hope you guys have a great rest of your night, and God bless.